Hello, hello, welcome back to my channel and to another reaction video. This time, we'll be checking out the movie Sand 2. James Cameron is involved. Hmm. Yeah, he didn't, director. It's not behind the uh, screenplay, but still. You know, it's uh, when it's underwater stuff, it's. <laughs> <laughs> uh, probably good to have James Cameron's backing. Uh oh no, is this one of those? We see the end at the beginning, and then the entire movie is following up. How this? How we got here now? <laughs> Papua New Guinea. Up for hair. Oh, you're kidding, what? Oh, you're gonna be in the shit. Oh, Mr. Fantastic. <laughs> so here she is. Yeah. That's the only emotions. thing I know this actor from. No, wait, he was. He was in Titanic, wasn't he? He was one of the um, crew members working on the lifeboats. That's a deep hole. But yeah, it would really be very exciting to explore. Kill you in flash. Engage manual mode. Ah, he, he played his, um, he played Dracula in that crappy Van Helsing movie. Okay. Natives are probably thinking, yeah, another group of crazy white folks <laughs> exploring oh what could possibly go wrong diving in caves <laughs> everything yeah i can feel it no virgil scanned that whole set that would be really dope uh studying underwater caves i've seen a few documentaries and there are always such beautiful footage but I've also seen some dream documentaries when shit goes really wrong. The largest unexplored cave system in the world. I wonder if that cave we saw the opening in the in the forest is a real location or I mean them inside the cave with what we saw that's obvious set piece, but I don't know. Rain? No, no, we're good for a few days yet. Oh. Ah, we're saved. Thank God. So is there, is there some going to be some kind of cave in that prevents them from getting the surface? They have to go, you know, find a, another way out. Is there going to be a hurricane or something and the cave's going to start flooding? It's bullshit on so many levels, I'm not even going to address it. I've given you every piece of equipment. Okay, that's, that's already some tension between these two. That's going to be some... You know what? Check this out. Some fighting among us while in there. Five years old. Do you think this is some downhill ride that you can just party? Frank. He was due for a break. Every the dad's gonna die, but they're gonna have a, you know, a moment where they resolve their issues. Problems. I won't be back till the 13th. Oh, clear, <laughs> Look, deal with them, will you? Tell them. Hello? Oh, okay, that's some um, little wonky the CGI. Okay, so the cave wasn't a this opening wasn't a real thing. Easier than you are. Yeah, I'm gonna marry her one day. I need to look at the earlier footage, but yeah, CGI. Tell him you can kiss my ass. Oh, parachute. <laughs> Ah, 
I mean, that would be extremely <laughs> risky. I mean, if you know what you're doing, sure. But even then, one mistake and you slam against the wall and... Where Alf, the sacred river, ran. Measureless to man. Under a sunless sea. <laughs> okay. Well, like that uh, to him, this uh, escape exploration is almost a spiritual thing. Then there's the jokester. You good, hmm. Liz? How long did they take him? Decompression. Uh, hmm. One hell of a set, um, uh, set up. You can scale. Having a portable decompression chamber. No. But yeah, they did mention this one guy's a billionaire. Scuba police. Ouch. Drinks are on you tonight, Jutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on, Jutes. Look at this. What is it? The silk's pulling through here pretty fast. Imagine doing this and getting stuck. Oh. Squeeze. Yeah, okay. Someone's getting stuck. Can you do Roger that. I'm all good. And there's so many people. There's a bunch of. Uh, that's a way to kill a bunch of these folks. I mean, that, it's annoying they showed the beginning that the sun in the water, so we know he. I don't know, maybe survives. I mean, he was. He seemed to be conscious, but somewhere. But then most of these folks will die by drowning or some yeah. I haven't done this for a while. Finally some excitement. And okay, this is gonna be super risky. This is kind of the. Stay cool. Deep and slow, dudes. This is panicking. <laughs> what do you mean? Where? Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Don't do it! We're gonna lose you both! Yeah, I mean... Oh, no, she's not gonna... Uh, she's panicking. That is, uh, I mean, yeah, she was panicking and, I don't know, what do you do in that situation, I have no idea. Oh, okay, so there is a storm coming. And it's gonna Frank, flood the cave, they're not gonna be able to come back in. Mm -hmm. I brought the ball, yeah, the comms let's down. get wasted. It's fully the fiber connector. And when you get up there, find that chopper and keep you. Fine! Yeah. Would you? I suggest you keep out of this! So who? Engines are building. <laughs> it's gonna fl flood so fast, so hard. And then the air packet there 
currently having that little base camp, it's gonna fill up and then they all have to go down. Signs of flooding. No, we, we can't just leave them down there. Oh, too late. Uh, the other guy went, went there as well, okay. It is a brave thing what the sun did, but also kind of stupid, they're all gonna get trapped now. Okay, what's gonna happen? Is the, the rope, is, the ladder is gonna break. Uh oh. Oh no, this this guy's gonna get crushed. Oh shit! And everyone's gone. No way, so here gonna be able to hold that rock. Oh. 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 I might have a cracked his skull on the... <laughs> oh, he got, got a hold of me, maybe. Oh no, shit. Alive and warm and dead, so show me what to do! You will need this! I'm fine in this prank! Uh, is he still uh, alive? Yep. He's still alive. George, we have to go. Real bad. No, nothing. Is he gonna? I don't think he's gonna make it, and I think this is gonna be, you know, they need to put him out of his misery situation. Didn't hear to die. I don't intend to. No, no. Yeah. Some really nasty business. I do like this music, really. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. I don't see has a character that dies. I think she might survive, so she might initially get a little stuck, but she's gonna make it. I don't know. They set this uh, this thing up that someone's gonna get stuck there, but I don't know. It might have been a red herring. I don't know, maybe she will die. No, she's panicking. Oh, yes, no. Okay, he go. He's gonna go. She's gonna pop up. Right. No. Okay. okay. But yeah, there were those two, two guys who did get out of the cave before the sun and the Picard, whatever his name is, went back to get these folks. I wonder if we're gonna follow, you know, the topside people at all. It would be interesting if we're only gonna now, from now on, follow these, trying to survive while not knowing what's going on topside. Other than there being a, you know, a hurricane and all. Get on oxygen. Oh no. They did mention 
They mentioned she had, yeah, George had something. George had some condition why he could, wasn't able to dive anymore, but yeah, I guess that's gonna be an issue for him. <laughs> Who's that to be so scary? But I mean, I'm, I'm sure people who does this kind of thing for a living know take risks, so... Uh, oh, shit. You're right. But yeah, I, I think... Um, yeah, the Just lead guy is... Oh, uh, he has the mentality of, you know, hope for the best plan for the worst. I, still so think I don't think he's wait. really hoping. If... Yeah, we've got enough... I don't know. You right? <coughs> no, obviously not, but he's gonna say he's okay. Go. Will we see George again? I think he knows he's a goner at this point. He's got the bend. He doesn't want to slow us down. There, he's right, right up. Oh, he left his equipment. I know what you're doing! Yeah, damn, George. George, where are you? Oh, uh, hmm. George, where are you? Holy shit. George! George, where are you? Damn, slowly. Drowning in his own blood. Man, that's tough. So how long until they're trying to kill each other? George is gone. Oh, what do you mean gone? Yeah, he fizzed up. He's gone. Decompression sickness, okay. So yeah, the special effects that they used in this movie, they don't... Uh, I don't think they quite hold up. But still. So far it's been a, you know, very enjoyable movie. Not the, not the best, not great, but pretty good. Don't, I don't regret starting this movie. And, Okay. I mean, we know. And the sun is gonna, isn't gonna die here. Because we saw in the fucking beginning. Why do movies do that, you know? Entirely sure what happened, but I mean, she did snap her spine when she fell and got sucked in there. Oh. Honestly, didn't see her going that way. We've only got one rebreather left. You heartless bastard! But this is gonna be the. They're gonna be. Who the hell do you think you are, are gonna fight and I don't know, this guy might just kill the dad. 
how did you become like this? Lost too many friends along the way. I don't know, the sun might, you know, get... It might survive. I mean, at the beginning we only see him conscious in some pool of water, but yeah. It might be now, that, that scene might be now seconds from him getting away from here. Sure, Frank. Whatever you say. Oh no, he's gonna... Yep. Left them behind. Just going blindly in different holes. It's gonna be on the other side of a hole. Going through the ceiling. Are there any pockets of air? May might. Well, the rich boy is gone. Are they gonna find his body somewhere along the way? He didn't make it, or is he gonna come back? Come back? You can dive, but you can climb. That shit. Do you think there's a way out? Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> Spoilers are gonna be swinging bats there, hunting them down. <laughs> no, I don't think the rich guy's dead. We're gonna see him. He's gonna come back and be an issue. <laughs> oh, that's. Uh, let's hope that doesn't start flooding. Oh no, someone's gonna slip and fall on. No? Oh. I'm waiting for the shit to go really bad. No? Okay. That would have been a perfect scene to have something go wrong. I'm waiting for Gollum to pop up. <laughs> if you've seen the descent, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Natural light. Is it salvation or false hope that they're seeing? Ah, okay. But yeah, there there isn't, you know, a way up. You don't see every day. A tank. A bloody tank. That's a cool shot scene, you know. A tank. They're all over this place during the war. Ah. Tank rolled up the Gave, gave away under its weight and fell, um, creating this. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They survived falling, but they didn't survive, you know, being down there. Imagine going hiking in a in a jungle and then you suddenly you just fall to a Cave like that. Assumption is the mother of all fuck ups. Huh. That sounds familiar. Oh, she's teasing us. Oh, don't take it personally. Yeah, Assumption is the mother of all fuck ups. That's um, uh, under siege to a crappy Steven Seagal movie. But yeah, <laughs> took me a while to remember where I heard it before. It's probably from some other stuff as well. You should, uh, you should be more careful. What's going on with the dad? Is he injured? Did I miss something? Craig? Is that you guys? 
This is uh, basically the toilet of this. I don't know, it would have been better if he, he just, you know, okay, he steals the, uh, steals the rebreather and whatnot and just disappeared into the... Nice shallow breaths. What about Carl? And they were lucky that the river dumped the uh, lady's body. Oh, shit. Pointy rocks at the end. Uh, and it punks are is long. It'll be fine. Oh, of course, he's still alive. Oh. Is he gonna dr drown himself, maybe? Or try and. No. Hmm. It's kind of good that the um, Carl Lee didn't die. I mean, it would be tough guy for this kid to, you know, You've got better instinct than me. To live with the fact that he had killed someone, but yeah, he didn't, so. I don't want this to take too long. No, no, no. Oh no, he has to drown his... Holy shit. Yeah, he's gonna get stuck and... Not, not find his way around. That's a tough call. But yeah, no, I don't think he could have let him die slowly. And he did ask for help, so. Where Alf, the sacred river ran. And cool, you can see on this uh, um, ceiling of the cave a small air package. Oh shit, yeah. There he is, he didn't make it. And to think about the, in, uh, there have been incident, you know, incidents where people have got gotten stuck in caves like this, so who knows how many there are, uh, there are trapped in caves. Imagine going, you know, exploring a cave and then Trying to a dead corpse that would freak the fuck, freak the fuck out. Ah, of course, of course, it comes back around. Now, will he survive, or was the beginning a red herring, just showing he's still in his last moment before getting something, something? I don't know. Ah, now he's. Goodbye, air. I mean, how good would the air be in a place like this? That's a cool shot. Yeah, I would imagine the air is pretty bad, so... Uh, just... Oh, and this is the beginning. I'm your guy. Are you home yet? Time to go, as in time to die, or time to. And Carl was so close to get out, but he didn't have the um, extra tank that. Just had. 
Well, there you have it, folks. That was the sanctum. Okay, that was uh, pretty good. I mean, okay, let's put it out there. The CGI does not hold up. It was pretty bad at the beginning, and yeah. But after the cave flooding, it was pretty intense, and yeah, there were some pretty sad moments the way some of these folks died. I think it was unnecessary to have, you know, Carl turn into this antagonist and have him kill the dad. They could have simply had, I don't know, find another way. But yeah, okay. You see, it was the rich dude and yeah, asshole and whatnot. And we, we saw him then drown. I mean, that should have been his uh, arc after he stole them equipment he goes there and just disappears into the cave system we never hear from him again but yeah and i did call it that after the cave flooding we never return to the surface to see what people are doing i mean we kind of uh, found out what what's happening up there through the dad he he said that yeah no one there's that they're not looking for that there planning for body recovery or something like that, but yeah. Honestly, I didn't expect it, the girlfriend of the rich dude. I, I don't know, so for some, some reason, she had that. I thought she might survive, but and I, I'm not entirely sure what happened when she got stuck in that creek, so. Uh, at first, when the I think the sun la light up her face, she lost grip, and then her hair got stuck into the brick, so when she cut that off, she lost all balance and fell. That when she fell, like, I don't know how long that was, but then she snapped her back and got sucked into the whatever that current was. But lucky for them, her body was... Uh, brought to that one location where they got some little bit of extra air And yeah I did like the uh, the actors they were I think really good and I Especially I mean, the highlight was the the father-son moments in the in here They were clearly estranged by but then this event brought them closer, and yeah, at the end he did say he's glad he got to know him. But yeah, I don't know. I, I call it from the beginning that dad was gonna die, but the way he died, I don't know. I, I think I would have preferred that both the father and son were, would have survived, but... <laughs> and yeah, it was tough seeing the, that uh, father do all the tough decisions he knows he has experience he knows when someone is a goner he he went out the same way he put well, what's his name loop or whatever so yeah who knows how many time, times he's had, had to experience this shit i'm the most haunting was the first one when that lady panicked and just drowned there that scene was just like Ugh. that's a <laughs> <laughs> uh, realistic nightmare right there. I don't know. People like who do this stuff for a living just for shits and giggles and some to, you know, uh, bring back footage of just what's underneath their feet and in the... I mean, the, those are the one places that explorers haven't, you know, ruined, so... I kind of get why adventurers do the, the, do that, and but yeah, it's always sad when stuff goes bad. But I ho hopefully, people who do it, they understand the risks and whatnot. I know a lot of people. I've seen some, you know, documentaries about cave exploring and stuff like this gone wrong, and the comment sections are usually a bunch of assholes just mocking them and whatnot. So uh, don't bring any of that shit in my comment section, please. But yeah, I don't know what do you guys think about the movie. Personally, I, I think it's pretty pretty good. Aside from the CGI, it doesn't hold up. But yeah, it's pretty good movie. No, not great, not the best, but 
pretty good solid one time movie don't re definitely don't regret watching and yeah it had very some very intense moments uh, but yeah the biggest mistake was at the showing the end at the beginning showing jaws floating there so he's the only survivor well i yeah I mean, I su suppose it could have been a red herring only showing him and then, you know, have some other folks survive. But yeah, as we saw the movie, that uh, that wasn't the case. Yeah, and I, yeah, I don't understand why some movies do that. And yeah, the one thing that really, uh, really added to the tension you know, and what was, there wasn't a whole lot of, Music not, you know, memorable, except the one when, especially after they left the, uh, the initial base camp to go diving, there was this really, really uh, creepy music playing on the background, so quiet, but yeah, so eerie at the same time. I really love that, really need to add that to the playlist. They did play it at the end a little bit as well. But aside from that, the, uh, really don't uh, mem re remember no, not really aside from that one track not a memorable soundtrack this movie wow my English is bad <laughs> I do apologize for, um, for that but yeah what do you guys think write your thoughts down below hope you like subscribe and another video bye